hello viewers thank you for watching and thank you for subscribing to my channel as the whole world is under quarantine we are under lockdown for the first time in recent history um, it's a measure of trying to control the spreading of COVID-19 or coronavirus no one wants to stay at home this time and many people are not comfortable staying at home for long hours I am one of them I thought of other people who are like me who don't feel comfortable staying at home for long hours or for many days so for that reason i decided to make up a list of things we can do to try to enjoy this time or get the best out of it so stay with me see what i have for you I tell you the tips on how to survive this uh, quarantine period let me start by trying to explain the meaning of the two words as many of us are using both of them quarantine and self-isolation or isolation health authorities around the world use isolation and quarantine to take care of infected people and their contacts in cases of contagious diseases and this also helps to, pre to protect people who are not yet infected to avoid spreading the diseases that are contagious isolation is separation of ill persons who have got contagious infectious or uh, communicable diseases so that they can start on their treatment journey and prevent spreading this disease to others who are still okay who have not been infected yet quarantine is restriction of movement of those who may have been exposed to uh, people with communicable diseases but have not got any medical diagnosis or uh, positive signs or symptoms that's why you had many countries whenever people landed in the country they had to go into quarantine so that they can have tests some who were positive were isolated and started treatment but those who had no symptoms had no signs but had been exposed to these people had to go into quarantine for a while at least 14 days as we know that's the incubation period for the disease to confirm or to rule out if they are not infected or they are infected with the deadly virus wherever this uh, quarantine is finding you with uh, friends relatives or family or alone these tips will help you to make it fun to enjoy it to keep calm to avoid the anxiety depression or frustration and we are going through this together so if you have anything that you feel has worked for you or has worked for someone else feel free to add it into the comment and the comment box so that others can get to use it and benefit so let's get started first thing you have to do is to keep up to date with uh, with the developments on the disease or the quarantine try to only follow the major media companies not everyone who's giving information knows what is right so if you don't follow in the information or the news you may end up waiting too late in the quarantine you realize after a week when people started working and you're still in your self-isolation you don't know what's happening so it's better to keep informed but however avoid rumors make sure the information you're getting is from reputable companies like uh, big media companies we know of the international companies like CNN BBC those will help you to get the right information and the local major media companies in your country wherever you are I mean UAE we can talk of college news we can talk of Gulf news or the Ministry of Health and we also have one which is the um, the press agents for the country for the nation this will give you reputable information or authentic information about the situation uh, the regulations and any measures that are being taken to ensure that we control the spread of the disease or we fight it and win it get back to your creator if it's been long without you talking to your creator wherever whatever religion you believe in worship places have been closed you cannot go for gatherings in the prayer places so you what you can do you can try to read the books the religious books this may not be a bad time to get back to your creator it's never too late and he will always forgive you if you are a Muslim you can try to read the Quran and if you can't read Arabic try the English version online or you can um, have a translated version and if you you're not a Muslim you have any other book like the Bible or whatever it is try to read it in that time that you have maybe it's a good time to get back to your Creator and try to understand more about your religion 
Another tip I have for you is to clean up your home. This could be a good time for you to get your house uh, neat and clean. You can do a general cleaning, walls, floors and ceilings. Make sure all is dusty, wiped and clean. All the furniture is clean. Or you can go ahead to even try to change the setup. Like try different setups. Um, uh, shift around the items, the furniture and see what works best for you. Because you have this time, you can just get make use of it. Tip number four, stay connected. Get in touch with friends, relatives, family members, and workmates so that you keep in communication. You know what's happening to everyone. You know that everyone is safe. We have a lot of ways we can keep in touch without moving, without staying at home, but keep in touch. We have social media, WhatsApp, Facebook, and many other social media applications that can help you do a video conferencing, like a video call, um, a chat, so that you can keep in touch. Like you can give comfort to to your friends and family. My other tip is eat healthy. Try to have the right foods. And if you you feel like the, your appetite is going down, try to cook differently. Try to look up recipes online, like on YouTube or on Google. Find out different ways of cooking the same food. Because after long, you may feel like you don't want to eat your homemade food. So try to spice it up. Try to, to, to change the way you cook it. And if you're out of what to eat, and you have some money with you that was you saved try to order online but don't avoid going out to buy it and if you get something right celebrate it uh, just share your photos with the friends but do not invite anyone for a feast it's not a good time to move so keep at home do your food eat it or share with the friends if you want to celebrate like success of um, finding out new ways of cooking biryani but do not invite people for a feast or don't go and visit them just stay at home and enjoy your new cooked dish the next tip is exercising after eating healthy you need to exercise but try to keep it in your house if you can but if you have a community that is not in the city you can try around your house but do not go on the streets if you stay in the city it's not allowed for many of the countries at the moment so you'll get into trouble if you go on the streets i try to get some sunlight or some some fresh air if you have a balcony, that's a good place to start with. Or if you can go down in the common area, but do not touch many things. Just have yourself protected with a mask and gloves so that you don't get in contact with places that may be contaminated. Um, this is something for your body to keep active. Do basic exercises. And if you don't know what to do, you can uh, look for exercises I can do at home on YouTube or online. You'll have basic exercise you can do in your house, in your living room, without having to go to a gym or to a common area. This is another important tip. Keep entertained. This means watch movies, listen to music, um, uh, watch Discovery Channel, look for anything that is entertaining, like series. If you have not subscribed to any of these entertainment channels, you should think about it. Maybe uh, there's some like um, Amazon they have a TV that will give you some programs. You can choose what you want to watch. Fashion, lifestyle, movies, series, etc. You have others, your local TV stations. Try to watch and see what's happening. And they'll be good source also for information apart from entertainment. Um, you can subscribe to Netflix for latest movies. Or you can just look out for things online on YouTube. Many, many things are there for you to keep entertained. In addition to, getting, to, to keeping yourself entertained, you can try to make out uh, playlists of music. If you have a collection of music on your laptop or your computer, try to change it and make playlists and see if you enjoy it. Make another one or uh, shuffle it around. That's another way of spending time and keeping yourself entertained. This will keep you, your mind busy so that you don't get into this depression, anxiety and panic. Read some books. It's another tip I think would be helpful for people who like reading. You can read novels, you can read uh, self-development books. And if you don't have the hard copy and you really want to have that hard copy, you could order it online with Amazon and many other um, online shops that may be in your country, wherever you are. Or you can try to read an online version. It could be a PDF or it can be an audio version. All these options are available and there are many books from fiction from uh, adventure you can read uh, self-development books you can read um, about history there's a lot you can read online and everywhere around the world so try to read something so that you can build your your brain or your understanding about different things 
that's another tip I have for you. The next tip is uh, try out something new. Try knitting if you're a lady. Try drawing, try painting, try playing an instrument like a guitar if, if you can access it. That will keep you entertained and also like you learn something new during these tough times. So look at what you can do, maybe play piano and some of these can be played online like there are simulations instead of buying the guitar if you want to buy it or buying a piano you can play a simulation online so there are many things you can do you can try painting online like not online but using the computers instead of getting the paint and the brush you can do something on on computer you can try graphics these are just some of the things that you can do to keep yourself busy so that you don't feel depressed by this quarantine the last one i would recommend is try to research about our surroundings about things around you many of us in uae work within multinational companies we have friends from different countries from different backgrounds i suggest you you start by asking your friend about a source for reliable and biased information about their their culture if you want to know about um about ugandans and you have a friend from uganda so try to ask him which website can give me unbiased information about Ugandan culture? This way, you'll go to the right website and find the right information that is unbiased. Otherwise, if you just try to look for understanding Ugandan culture or uh, culture in Uganda, you may get un unbiased. You may get biased websites that will give you wrong information, and you start hating your friend. So, in this case, I recommend you ask that person, your close friend where can i get reliable information about your culture i want to learn more about your culture how you live your ways of life and what's happening in your country then you'll get the right website or the right uh, source for information that's it for the tips you can use or you can follow to try to keep entertained keep at home keep at peace avoid anxiety and avoid depression and enjoy this quarantine period no one wants it but it's a main way it's a it's the most powerful tool we have again is COVID-19. At the moment, we don't have the treatment, but researchers are working very hard to get one. And the governments are trying the best they can to make sure that we are safe. So what I suggest, follow these tips. If you have more, you can add to the comment box, but keep at home. Don't move if you don't have to. If you have to, it should be a genuine reason that cannot wait. Something that cannot wait, then you may have to move. But if it can wait, please stay at home, keep safe, Wash your hands regularly. Uh, use sanitizer if you don't have soap. Uh, keep a mask on if you have to move out. And that is if you must move out. Keep the mask on. And try to avoid visitors. And try avoid visiting. Keep at home. Stay safe. Let's all fight this deadly, invisible COVID-19 virus. Thank you so much for watching. Keep watching my videos. Keep subscribing. Keep sharing.